So what does fortune do on an axe? Well, I'm going to show you. And it's kind of interesting because I actually only just barely came across this, and this is something I actually never knew. So I'm kind of new to this fact. Haha, <laughs> something in Minecraft I didn't know. Seriously, let's go ahead and put this on our axe. I'm just going to do it really quick just so we can go about it. Okay, Fortune 3, of course, is the best. Seriously, like, even 15 minutes ago, I didn't even know this. That's why I'm making this video, because I just learned this. If you put fortune on an axe, it increases the likelihood that you get saplings, sticks, and even apples out of leaves. Oh, I gotta be in survival, of course. Haha. <laughs> so, you know, like when you break it with your hand, it's just a regular drop po probability. But when you have fortune, especially fortune 3 on your axe, increases the likelihood of dropping saplings and sticks. Now, if it's an oak tree, it also increases the chance of getting apples. Look at that. Of course, it doesn't mean you're going to get, like, ridiculous amount, but it does increase the chance. So if you're out somewhere trying to get saplings... Huh. I'm actually not getting very many saplings all of a sudden. I got a couple there at the beginning, right? Oh, I'm having bad luck all of a sudden. Oh, come on. Really, guys, I'm not making this up. That's that's the mechanic. And I read it up on the Gamepedia, you know, officially released by Mojang, whatever. So they're the ones that said it, not me. But that's what it's supposed to do. It's supposed to increase the drop of the saplings. As far as I know, that's one of the few things it does. I think... I think, yeah, so, um, the fortune on the axe actually also affects melons, uh, beetroots, but only the seeds, uh, carrots, potatoes, wheat, uh, only the seeds again, from wheat, it's only the seeds, uh, and grass, so you're supposed to get more grass, or seed out of grass, gosh, that's what it says on the site, I one. It's actually not working. Oh, there it goes. It goes some. Of course, it says it just increases the distribution, meaning it just you know it's just a higher chance. Doesn't mean you're going to get a really high chance. It's just a better chance. I'm kind of disappointed that I'm not getting as many saplings from it as I thought I might. But it at least is an increased probability. But it's really good for like melons, you know, getting tons of melons. You know, as I think about what's efficient, uh, you know, the amount of time it takes you to chop down every one of those leaves versus you just going chopping down another tree and letting for them decay on your own might be still more efficient to just go chop down another tree and let it drop than using your Fortune 3 axe to get things like saplings. But, I mean, at least you know what they do, you know. I, I definitely use it on melons. Or, uh, what is it? Uh, oh, uh, I'm pretty sure it works on nether wart too. I know it does with a pickaxe, so an axe it's got to work. So yeah, fortune 3 on an axe increases nether wart drop chance. So remember that. Okay, well, I think that's all this video. Very interesting stuff. Very interesting.